Hello. GS350 JPN in the house. I'm on my way to work again. Anyway, last night I was at this, uh, one of my lessons, right? And I want to um, tell you about what happened in the lesson. It was really funny. Um, the, I wrote these conversations, I wrote my own material, and I wrote this story called Two Views. And no, 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 it wasn't called Two Views, it's called A Change of Mind. Okay, I want to read the story, but anyway, we read the story, and usually at the end of the stories, I had these questions, but for this one particular story, you know, because as, you know, the students progress, I want them to be able to express themselves and stuff, so she, uh, so the girl, uh, Aya, the one in one of my other videos, who said the, uh, about love, or something like that, is the, uh, agreement of the senses, or something like that, one of those videos. And um, she wrote her story, and oh my God, it was so funny. It was it was, it was cold, you know. But anyway, I'm, I'm gonna read both versions, okay? And um, I don't have anything for you guys to really look at because I gotta sit this down. So it's just gonna be up like this, and I guess you guys can uh, look at my. Uh, Paneling for the roof and all that stuff. Anyway, the name of the story is called A Change of Mind. Okay. And this is how it goes. Um, it's an A and B story. Okay. Um, it's an A and B story. I don't know if y'all can see anything. A and B. A and B, they're people. Okay. I know I usually use, use names, but I just stopped doing that. So anyway, this is the story and this is how it goes. Okay. A. Um, wait. The title is A Change of Mind. A, I am not going. B, excuse me, what did you say? A, I said I am not going. B, going where? To the restaurant. What? I had a change of mind. Well, I think you better have another change of mind. I don't want to go with you. What? What do you mean by with you? Like I said, I had a change of mind. I am going to a bar with my friends. No, you are not. We made plans and you will stick to them. Listen, every time we go out, it's boring. I am tired of hearing you talk about the same stuff. Well, if you feel like that, then go be with your friends. Okay? So, usually, with um, with my conversations and stuff like that, we just, um, you know, we'll talk about it and have questions. But this time, you know, uh, I um, asked uh, the students to uh, make their own version of the um, story. And this is... What it is, just write your own version of the story, and this is what she wrote. Okay, I want to read it's funny, it is funny. Okay, anyway, she does it A and B. Okay, and it starts from A. Okay, and it go A. Can I answer the phone? B, yes, you can. Five minutes later, A says, Sorry, now um, my friends just invited me to go to a party, so I will go with them. B says, Are we on a uh, uh, we're on a date now. Why would you um, go with them? A says, I know, but I changed my mind. B says, why? Which is more precious, friends or me? A says, of course, friends. I am tired of going out with you. You always take me to the same places and talk, <clears throat> and talk same or talk about the same things. It's boring. And B says, do as you like. Or, um, and then at the bottom it says, uh, I can't believe you said that. But anyway, um, when, uh, <clears throat> when, she, when I read that, I was like, wow, that is so cold, you know. Um, her character, my character, you know, broke up, broke the date off before, you know, they started going, before they went out. Her broke it off during the date. And I was like, wow, that is so cold. And she just told me straight up that um, girls in Japan, they do that. You know, it's normal. And I was like, wow. And then she says, what she says, though, is what they do is they'll um, call their friends. Like, if she's on the phone at home and she's talking to one of her friends, and instead of um, saying, oh, I'm busy or whatever, you know, she'll have, she'll, you know, whisper to her father and tell her father to tell her to go take a bath or something like that. And then it'll make it seem like um, it's someone else's fault that they have to hang up and not her, 
you know, and I was like, wow, and she said, yeah, she does that to her friends, like, um, she said, like, when Japanese girls, if they go on a date with somebody and they don't uh, like the date or if it's boring, then they'll, because they everyone out here, they're always emailing each other, and um, when it, an email comes, they don't, whoever they would, it doesn't even matter, they can be with their mom, boyfriends, or whatever, and they'll just start emailing, and what she does is, she said, what they do is they, um, email their friends and tell their friends to um, tell their friends to um, email them or call them you know most of the time maybe call them and um, then that'll be their excuse tell them something you know and that'll be their excuse so they can get out of the date or uh, get out of whatever um, engagement they have with their friends and stuff and I was like wow that is so cool she said yeah it's normal you know, people do that here, and I was like, wow, that's a trip. But it was funny. But anyway, I just thought I'd uh, uh, share that with you. That was yesterday's uh, conversation and stuff. It's it's interesting, you know. Just imagine, you know, going out with a girl, and she get a telephone call, and all of a sudden she's like, oh, I got to go. My mom wants me to go home. <laughs> and you're in the middle of a date, or you're in the movie theater, or you're in the middle of a dinner. I mean, because I'll tell you the truth, you know, it's probably no different than in the States, you know. You know, you got a um, date, and maybe the guy and the girl's dating, and she's really serious, and the guy might forget that it's they've been dating for a year, and he's not writing no dates down, and she's writing everything down. And out in Japan, they, a lot of these women do that, you know. But in the States, I'm sure they do that too, or they used to do it when I was coming up. And you'll forget, and then all of a sudden, you know, today's our anniversary, why don't you bring me a present, you don't love me, I'm bowed by, you know, stuff like that. But it's, it's just a trip. But anyway, just thought I'd share that with you. So, uh, if you're on a date, when she's emailing you, dun 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 dun, dun now you know what's coming. All right, peace.